All right, another episode of Make It Make Sense. So when are we going to start holding Mark Cuban, you know, accountable for what he has done to the Mavericks? Uh, when are we going to start doing that? Because he keeps getting a pass and the Mavs keep getting worse. You know, first, you know, they get rid of Donnie Nelson because he can't get along with the guy that Cuban brings in, this this Bob Vulgaris guy, this gambler to help him run, you know, and run analytics, which was an absolute nightmare, just a nightmare. This guy didn't get along with anybody, didn't get along with Luca, didn't get along with Rick Carlisle, doesn't get along with anybody, but you get rid of Don Nelson because he doesn't get along and that ended up blowing up in your face. And then now that guy is gone. It's just absolutely ridiculous. Fast forward to, you know, the whole Jalen Brunson. I mean, that is just a nightmare. First of all, it's Luca's boy. You know, he wanted him. He helps you when Luca got hurt. He kept everything afloat and kept the Mavericks going. They were winning games while Luca was out last year. And then you don't even try to sign him to a contract. Not to mention, it would have been a smaller contract than the one he got with the Knicks. You didn't even offer it to him. And now he is blowing up in New York. Luca's pissed off, been just disinterested all season long because of it. It's just been an absolute nightmare. And that all falls on Mark Cuban. Nobody else but him. Then fast forward to this year. Then you make the trade for Kyrie Irving. Look, we all know what Kyrie brings to the table, but as far as defense and what you had to give up, mm -mm, absolutely not. And Luca has pretty much said so. The chemistry of the team, which is his nice way of saying that Kyrie is not working out, the chemistry has is not the same as what it was last year, and we got to do something to get that fixed. Well, what do you think he's talking about, man? Come on. And I'm not blaming all this on Kyrie. I don't think Kyrie did anything wrong in Dallas. It just wasn't a good mix. And what Kyrie doesn't do is play defense. And the guys that you gave away, they played a defense. And you were not able to outscore your opponents to be able to win these games because you could not defend. Period. And now, you just tank the season. And then you just literally just tank the season. Just, oh, well, the guys are hurt. We're going to keep them out. You want to try to keep a, a, a top 10 draft pick? Absolutely ridiculous. Mark Cuban, you get no more passes, man. This is your fault. This is your blunder. I think we're all just wondering what you're going to do to rectify this and make it better. So anybody, somebody out there, please make this make sense.